Hey, Tokage. You just chilling there? Wait, what's this? Oh, oh, oh! <sighs> Whoa, no, the shirt is caught. Hey everyone, how's it going? So we are doing another unboxing today and I'm going to be accompanied by this new Tokage. Stop wasting tissues! <laughs> yeah, so this Tokage is actually one of the new ones that we got this time around and actually when I was getting this thing, it was uh, pretty simple. Somebody left it in a position where I can get it in one try so I just ended up trying to get it. But look at this thing! I really like tissue stuff. <laughs> okay, that's, I, gotta, I gotta stop. Let's go ahead and open the box and see what else is in here. First thing that I got is this little shark. Now if you've seen in my other videos before, you might have seen a Mochi Puni brand plush. This is the shark of the Mochi Puni uh, plush. Um, it was really simple. It was one of those small machines where you have those small plushies in those machines. You just have to lift it up and it's basically just like if you can lift it, you win it. So I managed to get this guy. Pretty cool. Really tiny. You can see it's like... Uh, you can see like it's uh, the size of my hand, so uh, it's pretty tiny. Other stuff that I got that were also like sea creatures, I got this Jinbei. Now, I didn't know that Jinbei actually has a whale that wasn't like the spotted whale shark, but it's like an actual whale. This guy's pretty cool. I got it in one of those platform machines and it was a pretty easy win for this one. But you can see that this guy is a little bit different because it has the little cat ears on it. So it's pretty cool, it's kind of cute. I mean, I like this one because it's kind of round and it's pretty squishy and you can see it squish. But you know, I like this guy, pretty cute, so. Not bad. I also got this other whale shark. Now I have no idea what this brand is, but look at this thing. It's so huge. It has a little seal on his stomach. I don't know if you can see it with the glare, but uh, he has a little seal. <laughs> I got this thing actually from a ping pong machine. And when you look at the replay, it looks like there's a lot of balls in the in the winning area, but it actually was the start position when I got it. So uh, kind of interesting that they would start with so many balls in there, but when I gave it a shot, I was like, all right, let's see if we can get it, and I managed to get it. So got this big shark, it's pretty cool. I did manage to get some other Pokemon stuff, so I got this, oh, Psyduck. <laughs> my, my tosses are really weird today. I got this Psyduck, and uh, look at this guy, he's so Psyduck. Duck, duck, duck. I got this one from one of those traditional looking crane machines where you know it has like the, the prongs and you have to kind of lift it. This one took a lot of tries to get because the crane actually didn't go over the hole. It kind of went a little bit to the side of it so when it drops it didn't drop directly into the hole so trying to make it so that you can like tip this over into the hole or trying to pick it up so that it could drop on the other end. It was really frustrating, really hard. It took a lot of tries to get this one so uh, you know glad I got it. Adds on to that side up collection that I got. If my friend didn't steal it from a long time ago <laughs> but you know it's all good all right so i also got another pokemon which is blissey the evolved form of chansey i i when i saw that chansey and blissey were on there i wanted to get both of them so you know i have to be a completionist so i decided to get both so here we go i managed to get this blissey also from one of those traditional looking crane things also took a long time to try to win it so uh, you know it's gonna be another tick on those uh expensive plushies to get from Tereba. Hmm. Hit. <laughs> but yeah, did take a lot of tries to get this one, but I'm very glad that I got Chansey. Er, sorry, this is Blissey. <laughs> oh my gosh, I've never seen a Blissey, uh, Blissey plush before. It's so cool that there's so many different plushies of different Pokemon. I've never seen them before in my childhood, so uh, it's nice to be able to have some of these things <laughs> now that they're available. As you know, I'm one for completionist, so for the last things I'm gonna show you on this uh, unboxing are these two rabbits and they're stuck in pancakes <laughs> they're really cute <laughs> so i got these in two different machines but you know I, I am a completionist so i have to get both so managed to get both of these things i think they were both on balance bars and um, when you see like one was able to just be lifted up really easily it just kind of was like in a position where it was slightly off of the bars and the space between the two bars were big enough that it fell through and then the other one was um, also on a balance bar so it's pretty cool. I mean, it's really nice to be able to get these things, but that's pretty much all that we got today. So I hope you enjoyed looking at this unboxing. If you want to see more Tereba content, please make sure to like and subscribe and share so that we can expand on our Tereba community. All right, I'll see you all around. <laughs> you can't see the expression. Oh, wait, that's because I'm holding it backwards. <laughs> Which one was your favorite today?